Maybe for this intro I should just do like every single time I say I like it. I actually really like them. Yeah, I love them. They're really nice. I really like it. Yeah, I really like it. I also really like it. I 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 like it. It's pretty nice. I like it, but it's cool. I like it. Hello my friends and welcome back to another YouTube video. So today I'm going to be doing a back to school haul. These hauls are like, I don't really know what it is about them, but like halfway through you get bored and you're like, you know what? I don't really care anymore. So I'm gonna get this vlog straight to the point so you're not bored like that. School's already started by the time I upload this video and I know a lot of you have like already started school in like August, but where I live, I start school in the beginning of September, like after Labor Day. Anyways, let's just get into this video. Okay, so first things first, this isn't really school related, but I got this like really, really pretty dress from Von Mar. If you don't know what Von Mar is, it's like a really fancy department store, kind of like Nordstrom, I guess. Guess how much it was? You know what? I'm just gonna tell you, it was $25. That's a steal. It was originally 260 so I won't be able to wear it for another like two-ish years because I'm going to be a sophomore and junior prom is in a long time. So now the actual school stuff. So first things first is the shoes because they're kind of sitting right here and you've probably already seen them. But I got some Vans. They are checkered Vans, but they're primary colors. And I really wanted just like plain primary color Vans. So I had to either get them custom made or buy these ones. And these ones are a lot cheaper because custom made vans are a lot more expensive. So I just got these ones and I actually really like them. Then I got some Doc Martens and I've been wanting Doc Martens like forever. And they're actually really expensive, like retail $140. But these ones I got on clearance um, online though, not in the store. That would be crazy. And then they also had like 20% off, I think. So I got extra 20% off and it's such a steal and like, I don't understand why these are like a discontinued style because they look exactly like the other ones. Okay, so I've been trying to thrift more of my clothes. There's this app called Poshmark, which is like where you sell your used clothing and stuff. And then when you sell them, they give you credits so you can either like deposit in your bank account or you can use as like a gift card to buy more clothes from there. And I have a lot of credits because I sell stuff and I got a lot of clothes from there. Also, I got clothes from normal stores because Okay, so these jeans are the most expensive jeans in American Eagle and they were $90, but hear me out. I got them for free. So if you buy like five pairs of jeans, you get one free if you're like with the rewards system at American Eagle and I got a free pair of jeans and apparently there's no limitation. So I naturally just bought the most expensive pair. They're super high rise. They're called the dream jean. I don't really understand what's so dreamy about them. They're just a little bit more stretchy, but we'll see. And then I got these jeans from American Eagle on clearance. They're like $30 and they're ripped, but like it, it doesn't go through. There's like another layer of denim underneath it and they're all high rise because I don't like any other jeans. And then I got these ones are vintage. Yeah, they're Tommy Hilfiger like mom jeans are kind of long so I have to cuff them at the bottom but I got them on Poshmark for like 40 ish dollars. I had enough credit so I didn't actually use any of my own money. Yeah, they're really nice and like there's no belt loop but it has a band. Ooh, I forgot my belts. I got some belts. Yeah, so I went to Brady Melville and it's in one of my vlogs and when I went to Ohio and they had a Brady Melville there. I didn't buy any clothes but I bought a belt and a pair of socks. I got this and it's like just a normal leather belt. Yeah, it was a pretty good deal. It was only $10. Well, I know these types of belts are over $10 normally. And then this belt I got on Poshmark and it has like uh, eyelets in them and stuff. And then this belt actually comes with a skirt. I got it on Hollister. It's in the wash right now. I completely forgot about it while I was filming this vlog. But basically it's this same pattern but uh, in a skirt and then this belt goes around the skirt but I can also wear it with jeans. This I also got on Poshmark. It's like basically the same as a black one. And then this I actually uh, made myself. Do you know those chain belts? They're like a trend now? Yeah, well they're also like $20 and that's too much. So I got some chain and an S hook. Boom, a belt. I'm actually really proud of myself. So I have a little obsession with Patagonia's. I have a three now, two of which I thrifted. I got this one from Poshmark for like $40. Here's another one that I got. It is like a burnt red type thing and I got it for $30. And then I got this leopard print from American Eagle. It's a large, which is not my size typically. I got it, I like it, it was on clearance. Then I got this shirt from American Eagle, no. 
Hollister. It is just a plain white shirt. I really needed one. And at the back, there's like this bow. This shirt, I actually thrifted. And it's from Hollister. This I got from TJ Maxx. And it's a plain white t-shirt. Oh, wait, it's black, not white. And it's a little bit different because there's like a little pattern on it that's sort of see-through, if you can see that. This one is like a little um, question mark. It's fine. Zip down. I thought it would look edgy if I wear it with some specific things. I don't know. Then this I got from Hollister and it's pretty similar to that other striped shirt that I showed but this one wasn't thrifted. And this shirt I also got from Hollister. It's like a mock neck ribbed yellow t-shirt. This I got from Plato's Closet. If you don't know what Plato's Closet is, it's like a consignment shop. Last thing I have with me is Athleta leggings. And Athleta leggings are typically more on the expensive side like Lululemon. I I had some gift cards and I was holding off buying them and I finally did and they're actually really comfortable. I also bought from ASOS these pants. I like them, like plaid pants are like a thing. And I also got these which are like chinos and they're also um pretty popular i forgot also from target i got like this oversized denim jacket that kind of reminds me of that guy from the breakfast club and then i got this like purple ribbed tank top there's that like, clearance and it kind of reminded me of something that uh, brandy melville so like imagine this tank top but purple so anyways that's about it for this video today and i hope you guys enjoyed it and don't forget to like this video and subscribe for some wholesome quality comedy content anyways i'll see you guys next time was that haul like good? Was it the correct length? Did like I hold your attention for long enough or was it like halfway through you found it unbearable and you didn't want to wash it anymore because that's often how I feel about hauls. Anyways, just don't forget to eat your vegetables.